are fundamental to the production of the main battery. The automation of equipment, the device-to-device -device implementization, and the intelligentization of control are central to this, underpinning robust and efficient processes for consistent growth. very recent future, we can see the fossil fuel cars have a, as a history. One question, what a globally, etra car like in global, across the globe, you can know, any guess? In the clear number of the owner, guess here. Million cars, every time the million cars are across the globe, one of the two million cars. If you are taking the count of EV in that, it's almost 9.5 million. So, if you have 25 million cars, you can have 10 million or EV cars. It's almost 12.6% of total car sales in the globe. Now, if you have a pure EV, if you are adding the hybrid, uh, plug-in hybrids, it will be 13.6 million cars. This is a global scenario. But in India, we have a little bit of a scenario. In India, we have almost 4 million cars. In this 4 million cars, 2.3% of the cars are EV sales. Evening there, we have the uh, introduction of the e, uh, Max uh, 7, which is the successor of EV6, E6. Uh, as you all know that, uh, the first product was E6, and then uh, with the uh, response, uh, the VUID was taking up in, in, in India and uh, with us also in Kerala. And the E6 was a great product uh, which was well accepted by uh, all of you, uh, most of the customers in Kerala and some of you uh, are also here. And now uh, again, uh, this E6 uh, is now getting into a more uh, bigger and a better price uh, with a new introduction uh, which, is, which you are all going to see now. So um, I know that you are all excited and uh, waiting for this, uh, to see uh, this uh, uh, Emax 6, uh, Emax 7 which is uh, coming up. Uh, so, um, I'm just, uh, I'm also uh, looking forward for this. But uh, let me uh, say something about uh, the way EVM has shaped up. If you see uh, the last three years,